There is something so dear, something so precious, something so internally true that it's been worth dying for. And I submit if, the, if somebody has not something, find where he is willing for to die. I say you, this person is not fit for life. That's freedom, that's right, that's justice, that's respect for any living being. There's peace, there's morality, there's justice. Justice for random living beings. That's the end of discrimination. That's the end of oppression, the end of arbitrary bullshit reasons to torment other living beings, to commodify them, to enslave them, to use them like animate objects, inanimate objects. That's what it means. Justice avoid the victims and screw all victimizers. Morality can only come from one source. And that's not ego, that's not malice, that's only compassion. Only, only when we have to learn to live in peace with all innocent living beings. We will find peace for ourselves. There is no nobility in protecting victimizers. Slave masters, rapists, murderers, meat eaters, they don't need your voice. The victims be the only one that need your voice. If you learn to respect and respect most innocent, the most harm, most harm, beings of all groups. Then we learn to be peaceful to other living beings. Then we can learn to forgive, forgive ourselves for what we, willing or not know, we're not willing or not knowing, have done. Watch any situation always around the victim's position. Because if you've not been the victim, he'd become pretty easily to mock and excuse and oppress. Because it don't affect you. But when you win the victim, it will things look a lot different from that angle. There is no excuse for it. So Please, watch always any form of oppression from the victim's point of view. If the animals be victims, or you be victim. But forget not the victim's point of view. What if a cow, a chicken, a turkey, or one dog, what have, what have they all, or donkey, what up, um, her before animal ever done to a human. <sighs> to deserve internal damnation. The general considered that goodness of character is indirectly with uh, kindness to animals, and it's, it's positively simple that how is cruel to animals cannot be a good person. Greatness. Moral contact to all innocent beings is the only guarantee of great moral combat. Only one that been forwarded will, with absolute surety, not enter some innocent one. Animals be not food, clothing, or entertainment, just like. 
women be not punching bags or rape toys for their husbands and boyfriends. Just like blacks be not slaves only for the service of the white men and gays be not aggression punch bags for heterosexist men. Awaken humanity. One struggle, one fight, and more liberation. Destroy speciesism. Destroy the arrogant contempt from humans that have been more special and more holy and more important than any other living being. Destroy human supremacies. It's just as arrogant and despicable as white supremacists and as black supremacists. Awaken humanity. You be not better. You be not more holy than other living beings. There have been different, but I mean not lesser. Go vegan. What's the excuse for causing the least amount of harm possible on this planet? Eat beans, lentils, lagoons, potatoes, rice, fruit, bananas, oranges, etc. But animals be not food. Awaken. There be persons with one own personality. With their own character, went on on dreams.